missed your face. There we are. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, uh, <laughs> it's got to be wild. You used a lot more than when you did rehearsal. <laughs> Okay, good morning everybody and welcome back to another vlog of the Batista vlogs. We have arrived at York Maze. They have kindly invited us to um, come to their event. It's a Halloween event so it looks pretty good from the outside. So we're going to take you guys inside and show you guys what it's all about. This place looks absolutely amazing. You got skeletons hanging upside down from the trees, everything. We're all inside of York Mace. Um, we'll fill you guys in on some information, what they have got going on in this event. But so far, guys, the outside looks absolutely amazing. I just can't wait to get into the whole entire maze and have an absolute like look around. It just looks really, really intriguing. So we're gonna go in the Halloween house of confusion, guys. Ooh, Ooh confusion. Don't get too confused, guys. <laughs> so also, guys, we do have a Halloween scream as well, if you're older. Yeah. Do you want to go for that? We're not coming here for that, we're coming for the children's event. So they've today. got loads on, haven't they, for Halloween? And I think that's the event there, the second event for you guys who are our older subscribers. So check that out. I'll leave a link down below for that as well. Oh wow, look at this place, it looks pretty trippy. It looks so trippy. of confusion. Uh, Al. <laughs> did you tip over? No. Uh, Logan, what did you think? Uh, really good. I want to go in again. <laughs> you want to go in again? It's really good. I definitely want to go back in. So you got the jumping pillows here, which is really cool. We always like to go on a jumping pillow. Okay, so the weather doesn't know what it wants to do today. It's raining, it's sunny, it's just one of those days that's a little bit unpredictable. But we're having loads of fun, so it means that it makes no difference at all, does it? So we've came to the maze of illusions. illusions. So let's see what's illusionally in here. Because that other place was the what was the other one, Stephanie? The House of Illusions. The House of Illusions was pretty good. So let's see what the Maze of Illusions is like at York Maze. This is pretty good, guys. I really like this place so far. Stare at the circles long enough, the circles will start to move. Okay, that is true. Okay, stare at it, guys. B-Fam, B-Fam, stare at it. See if they start to move the circles. Oh, they do. Okay, do not stare at them, guys. Do you see it, Caleb? Is it moving? Oh yeah, well they do move when you stare at them long enough. I try and say the colour Sean, so that's that in. The colour, okay, yeah. green, yellow, blue, Black. And then the top. <laughs> What's wrong with my face? Uh, blue, 
black, purple, green, blue. No. <laughs> Red. It's, I mean, it's blue, green. <laughs> That's <all. laughs> What's the, Why is my brain up? Yeah. So far it is really really good. There's lots to do for the children. There's lots of little um, different things it's like the mini maze. We've got the fancy dress parade. We've got some absolutely gigantic slides guys. We've got the um, corn snake slide. We've got the volcano slide. There's like amazing amount of stuff here for the children. Yeah, There's lots of people are fancy dressed up and staff are really nice so far. We're just gonna go a further in and show everybody a little bit more what it's all about. Yeah, I'll also show you. This is the map here, and this is all the things that they actually have on, guys. So there's a lot to do. Definitely a full day's worth of activities there. You can buy online, or you can just come down on the day. I will leave the website link down below, so you can go and check them out if you fancy coming. It's on until the 4th of November as well, guys. Right here we have face painting going on. So we're currently in the kids' pantomime, so there's a pantomime on for the children. I guess it's like Halloween theme as well, so I'll just record it all and show you guys what it's all about. Ladies and gents, this is the moment you've waited for. It's cold in this barn, the rock's coming through the floor. But this is nothing scary, that's a promise we'll ensure the stage is prepared. So now is the time, the York Maze Annual Pantomime. York Maze is the place to be this Halloween. For the finest pantomime you will have ever seen. In that case, I'd say it's most likely that lady over there on the third row. What? Really? That one with the teeth? Well, she wouldn't be the fairest if she didn't have teeth. No, no, no. She can't be the fairest. She has a butter face. A butter face? Yes. Everything looks all right. Butter face. <laughs> no, look here. You're supposed to say I'm the fairest, you stupid fella. If you don't want to be smashed to smithereens, you'd better take a good look at yourself. No, you take a good look at yourself! <laughs> Never fear, because for one show only, here on this stage, I have got joining me out there my other seven dwarves. Oh. Hands up, have I got some little dwarves out there? Let's have a little dwarf. Let's have a little Here we go. Hello there, what's your name? This is Cheeky. Everyone say hi, Cheeky. Hi, Cheeky. Come on, then you come up here then. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so here we go. We just need to pull out the floor covering. Here we are. And <laughs> it's a bit over the top, isn't it? No. I remember what you did to me in this scene last year. Right. Okay. Let's take this out. Yeah. This is uh, reassuring. Yeah. <laughs> There right, we go. Okay, okay. Now we need to make some more wallpaper paste. Wallpaper paste, and for that we need wallpaper paste powder. Wallpaper paste powder, look here. Yeah. Is this wallpaper paste here? No, no, no. <laughs> oh, sorry. What are you doing? Uh, the lid wasn't on. I didn't mean. I didn't mean to do that. Do what? That does oh, not. <laughs> Honestly, I'm, I, the lid isn't on properly. I had no intention for that to happen. No. <laughs> well, it's my turn this year. <laughs> We need some water now, Lon. Some water. Yeah. Water. Here. Don't worry, I was a bit good nights. <laughs> I was a bit more careful this time, but I don't know why you didn't just get the water from that leak over there. What leak? <laughs> <laughs> Stop! You then go through a stage where you can't stop yourself from singing. Things that can happen to you. Oh, and if only it ended there. Uh, the final stage of this horrible spell is that the consumer is condemned to a lifetime of endless flossing. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you dare film this! <laughs> I know I can't do it! <laughs> Sadly, we don't have any anywhere. That's where you're wrong, ghosty crow. Oh, sweetie! 
good. Sweet. What do you think all of you have been making some slime out there for us? What do we think was a girl who did us? Should we slime crew wait and put up a misery? Yeah. Right. Let's get a countdown from five. finished up in the pantomime back there. It's on for about, would you say, 30 minutes to 40 minutes or something? Yeah, honestly guys, it was so good. We were laughing all the way through. The kids really enjoyed it. It was yeah. one of the best pantomimes I've ever seen. And the humour was right on point for everyone. It was funny for the kids and funny for the adults. Like, we've been to some pantomimes from time to time and we've been left twiddling our thumbs because the jokes have been mainly for the children. But at York Mayors, these guys have got it so, so right on, haven't they? I would definitely say the pantomime is definitely worth going to see. Yeah, guys. I would come, just yeah. come here just for the pantomime because <laughs> was that good. funny. Yeah. Like, you're constantly left with a huge smile and just laughing all the way through, aren't you? Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I laughed so hard. Guys. What was your favourite part? Um, probably when they were doing the floss and stuff. Yeah, the floss and part where you couldn't do it, that was really funny. Yeah, I like the part when he got slimed just because I like slime in general. It was so really good. It's on every hour from 11 o'clock till 4 o'clock, isn't it? Yes, there's a show on every hour. Every hour, and I think it lasts about 30 to 40 minutes, and it's really worth going to if you are coming. I would definitely recommend it. Going to the show. So, we're going to go and catapult some pumpkins because we have a uh, catapult uh, pumpkin area, and then I think we're probably going to go and carve our pumpkins and then maybe just go for some food at the end if we've got time. Yes. Got the food, haven't we, Stephanie? <laughs> Looks quite heavy there. It is quite heavy, actually, guys. <laughs> so we're sitting like further at the back. We've also got like a sauce bar there for like your meal and your ketchup, your mustard and stuff. Nachos, guys. Look at that. <laughs> Lovely. We had some really nice ones at the other event we went to the other day, didn't we? We did. Guys, if you know us, you know that we love our nachos. We have to get nachos every time we go somewhere. <laughs> Also, the children's meals are really, really good sized portion meals. They get a full box of chips, this full size of chips, and then they get their chicken nuggets or mozzarella sticks. They haven't got mozzarella sticks. They actually have the UK's largest corn maze. So it's the biggest maze in the UK that you can go to. Well, it's actually birds of prey here, guys. Look at these. Look how beautiful these guys are. Look at this owl. Look how fluffy it looks. Right here, and I think it feels like we're actually on Jurassic Park. Do you feel like it's I think Jurassic you said Park? It's more like a pantomime as well. Is it? It's like a tractor pantomime, and you get a little bit wet. But so does it, it not remind? Water. Does it not remind you of Jurassic Park? A little bit. Yeah, yeah. I've the movie Jurassic Park. That's how I feel like I'm actually on on the Jurassic Park set. Oh, I'm just gonna go on this thing here. It looks pretty cool. One of your hosts for today and my co-host here christina columbus nice to see you yes that's right up on we've got our lovely driver susan everyone say hello to susan all right so it is halloween time and we've had a bit of a problem here at york rays with lots of ghosties around the place and some of them keep halloween <laughs> halloween anyone 20 minutes let's enjoy it you're gonna have the best 20 minutes of your life oh, okay, they go. They're Halloween! Terrible business! I am sorry, oh, no, 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 no. I don't it! That, what, where? Before the explosive 
Diarrhea stop! <laughs> In a moment, thousands of crows are about to descend upon you, pluck you up with their talons, drop you over here by the closet. I will then push you into the closet, and then I shall come out of the closet. Not for the first time. Ah, uh, yeah, can pack that right in. And then I'm going to press down on this plunger, which is going to ignite all the fireworks in the back there. And you're going to go, kaboom! <laughs> Oh dear. Uh, hang on a minute, Mr. Mummy. Out. There seems to be a flaw in your plan. One of the skeletons has escaped from your closet and is about to unravel your plan. Find you. Shut the door! Shut the door! PlayStation over here. Boom! Yay! 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 Let me out, mate. It was only a joke, wasn't it? But don't you even think about it, mate. Don't you? Not even one finger on that plunger. Wait, 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 wait. Oh yeah, funny bones, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you think? Should he push the plunger, everybody? Yeah. No! 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 Oh, look, you've done that one. Skeleton, let me out, please. I'll give you body back. I'll take you to the pop world. I'll point you a point. Oh, no. Oh, dear. There's half a world. I made it. I made it. Oh, dear. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Once again, you're welcome. Has he gone? He's gone! Yay! Yay! Give Mr. Skeleton a cheer, everybody. Well done, you! So we've just finished the tractor ride. That was so, so, so much fun. Well worth doing. If you guys ever come to York Mears, I definitely recommend doing the tractor ride. It is such a laugh. You do get wet, but it's just so funny. You don't even realise you're getting wet. It's just so funny. So at the carving station where you'll just carve look all these pretty cool carved pumpkins <laughs> it's crazy look at that that's amazing and that's a real pumpkin guys somebody's actually carved that on that is amazing as well as on that it took some time to do that by the looks of it this is Halloween. decorations guys these look amazing quite reasonably priced as well 